On February 7, 1904, the city of Baltimore was decimated by fire. It began at a dry goods store and spread rapidly due to winds. Thousands of businesses and residents were displaced as buildings were reduced to ash. The Baltimore Equitable Society provided fire insurance to 455 victims of the Great Fire. While the magnitude of losses forced other insurance companies out of business, the Baltimore Equitable Society paid their policyholders in full and continues as Baltimore's oldest insurance company. The Baltimore Fire of 1904 was not unique. During the 19th and early 20th centuries, nearly 30 large-scale urban fires struck the country from Boston to San Francisco. Though today, in Baltimore, a fire of the magnitude of that in 1904 seems unimaginable, fire remains a great danger in urban environments. The threat of urban fire is worsened by what Stephen Pine called a dead urban core, an area of abandoned lots and empty buildings that invite fire and arson. Currently, the vacant and boarded buildings on Baltimore's west side represent this threat. Renovating and repopulating the west side is the best way to reduce the threat of fire. While the Baltimore Equitable Society may still be around to ensure financial recuperation, much will be lost and the historic cityscape will be drastically altered by another great fire in downtown.